this is my home base. Um, it's an external vault. Sort of an external atrium, I guess. armor. to do is get rid of all the stuff I picked up. just for a legendary thing of which I have many many I don't have all of them in here. Some I've given some to some other characters. Like McCready has one of my legendary rifles, and uh, put some uh, some other containers, and I just haven't picked them up yet. But yeah, quite a lot. <laughs> my idea was to make a museum. Uh, display area with all these at uh, I wanted to do it here but yeah I can't do anything else here it's there's so much lag it almost crashes every time I come here anyway I was gonna make one at uh, the Boston Airport right near the Brotherhood of Steel because I figured they could guard it Alright, break down the weapons I just picked up. Whoops. Don't want to do that. Do that. Oh, I almost forgot. Uh, of course, one of the first things I also do is dump the junk that I've collected while I was out foraging into the workbench. Now, most people, myself included, in most settlements go directly to the workbench and dump the junk in it, but that's not entirely necessary. My workbench is over here on this settlement, and I'll show you why in a minute. 
So you just do jump shoulder and hit T and it puts all the junk in the workshop. But you don't have to do that. You can just go to any workbench like the workbench where I was for weapons and do the same thing. You just hit R transfer and it opens the workshop for you. And you can just dump your junk into there from here. You can ignore the original workbench entirely if you want. So the reason my workbench is here, I mean the way it's set up like this and it's enclosed in this little room is because uh, workbenches, unless you use a mod to move them, and I, I tried that and I didn't like the idea. It seemed too uh, risky. But most work, all workbenches actually, are locked in place. You can't move them. And this particular workbench, as you can see from these pictures, is at the very top of the tallest hill on this island. So what I did was I built a platform around it and then gradually worked my way out from that point and continued to add more and more complexity and uh, basically design this base. Eventually I added a large building area with concrete onto which I built this uh, vault atrium to house all the power armor that I was going to collect. And also, I built a, an entire area for housing some residents I wanted here, plus putting in some stores and uh, security and etc. So that's why it's designed like this. Okay, let's see if I got any legendary clothing items. That one I wear. Uh, some of these are for outfitting uh, provisioners. Not for me to wear. Okay, we got some power armor pieces. I don't think I have any to break down. Armored stuff is for my followers, and I mean for my settlers and my provisioners. Yep. Okay. And upstairs. It's where I keep the power armor pieces. I have all these power armors. I, they're kind of organized. There's, I left one at Starlight Drive-In. That's why there's an empty spot there. And all the other parts that I don't need, I put in here. And there's a lot of them. I might just sell all these one day. Well, I got the magazine. I don't put that away. My apartments. I have a ring that negates carry weight, but I'm not going to put it on yet. Do I have any cash? I've been trying to save some of the cash. And add 
just I gotta re alphabetize all these eventually. There it is, awesome magazine. This is the only one I picked up. There are 122, so that means this rack, this rack, this rack, this rack, that rack, and one more rack I need. I think there's 20 on each rack, yes? Yeah, 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 90. I've got 90. That means I have <laughs> 32 left to go. you got to be kidding me. Like, where are these magazines? Holy mackerel. <sighs> okay, i got to have something to eat and go to bed. And then tomorrow I'll go pick up my greedy. I used to have five or six pieces of perfectly preserved pie on this counter that I put here um, that I got from all the machines around the Commonwealth that I successfully retrieved a piece of pie out of it. So they were kind of like souvenirs. They were the ones that I had managed to get. I laid them all out here on the counter and they disappeared. And I think, I really do think that my settlers who come up here and mill around and use my apartment, they ate them. They ate my pies. <laughs> I was so mad. <laughs> they were all lined up in a row here. And they're gone. <laughs> oh, well. I, at least I got a photograph of them. Uh, 